Hello, this is Ilwe Gathers to Cupcake, and this is the first of many Wi-Fi battle views, or infrared battle views I will be showing, so here I am with me in my battle against James, uh, one of my good friends, and um, so yeah. So. I decided to start off with my Rotom, and he starts off with his Felix, so I'm like, oh man, bad setup. And of course I'm faster than him because it's a Felix, so I just couldn't decide to confuse him, because I can't paralyze him because he's ground. So he does pull off a curse, which is making me mad. I use Shadow Ball. Doesn't do like any damage to him. He hits himself in the field and does like no damage to himself. So he's Air Slash, does a little bit of damage. A little bit more than Shadow Ball did. So his hit punches, he's gonna do another clear, so I use Air Slash. And he is not confused. He goes with the curse. So I use Air Flash, now he's almost dead. If only I got the crit because he decides to blow up on me. Which kills him and in the long run ends up killing my Rotom. So it made me go mad. But yeah, so I found out my Kinja, my sweeper. Not that I expect to sweep him, and I know automatically that this is an Taiwan car before he was an Bot because the stand stream didn't go off. And can you guess what it actually is? <sighs> I'm not gonna tell you just in case some of you don't know. So I do manage to see right through it, and goodbye Zorak. So yeah, he goes with Escavalia, which blocks off my outrage, like entirely. But I do have boosted, so I do get rid of a lot of its health. But I do get confused, and he does turn me in the hole with my hand, so the confusion didn't really matter. <sighs> so I tried to go in for the other kill and use Fire Punch. So he's like, you are gay, and then I think I comforted it. And then I missed my Fire Punch, so I end up using Stone Edge on accident. And it does no damage. So he overkills it with a critical hit, super effective quick break on our own That's a pretty freaking overkill, my opinion. So I go to on and play on the turret attack to kill off his Kunkle dude. So he does a go like the wire, not knowing that I have hidden power ground for electric types. But it does, he does manage to live because he is somewhat buff in special defense. And he pulls up a cross top which kills my poor Lindsay. It probably would have lived if it went for a crit hit. But yeah, I go with my Lotic. And this is probably the longest point in the battle. But I, he does use Thunder Punch and it paralyzes me, which. Um, pa actually paralyzed me that turn, so he goes with Thunder Punch, but my marble scales up, so he doesn't kill me. I'm paralyzed again. I launch a Hyper Potion on him because I decide to be gay. So he uses Big Break, not knowing that I was going to do that. He launches my survive towards his uh, Zorark, not Tyranitar for you retards out there. 
So I use ice cream. He punches me again, I'm paralyzed again. And I go on maybe on him. He uses thunder punch, but I manage to pull off recovery. So, I heal quite a bit of health. He's gonna punch again. And I pull off another ice beam because uh, I like to die, so. But he just told me to know. If he is again, he's alright. He buffs. I use the cover. He buffs again. I use um I use ice beam and in retrospect I should have gone with surf. But yeah, it probably would have done more damage. So he uses my gaze and um kills off my myelotic. Because he is buffed twice in special attack with special attackers, so and I'm a physical defender with it. So I just think it'd be awesome and send out busy. So he's like, oh, you are Australia. And, uh, yeah. So, I'm just, um, using my person now. Speaking with Ice Beam. So I do freeze him. So I'm like, BA only. So I can't do anything about it. So I just taunt him by using Flamethrower to fall him out. There's furniture. So he uses, so he goes with Titan on car. I go, I decide to be gay again and use a, Max Survival on Polygon V. Because I know my Jesse was actually gonna die and there's no way I could take it out. So this is the ice beam. Freezes is still on the car. So my, my ice beam is on a freezing spree since Blissey. Every time I use ice cream, I've done a lot of it, so. I do that. He thaws out, but he misses the stone edge, so he uses a hyper potion. And keep in mind, we both used a natural rather hyper potion, so we are actually equal. So I go with the ice cream again. Freezes him again, so my, I have a 3 free streak with it. I've, um, yeah. So. He's all mad and everything, so I use Hidden Power Ground, super effective, still frozen, and I use Hidden Power Ground for the finishing blow. So that was me versus uh, James. So, I'm probably going to be posting more of these kinds of videos. I hope you uh, find them interesting uh, I know I would I really like to do them even if it's just watching a battle I don't really care it's um, kind of fun so I get to watch my ownage against other people so see you next time and uh, yeah I hope to hope you still turning into my videos eventually I will get quite a bit of subscribers so hopefully they will watch my videos and not just subscribe to me for no reason so yeah so bye